The Directorate of Enforcement Hindi, is a law enforcement agency and economic intelligence agency responsible for enforcing economic laws and fighting economic crime in India. It is part of the Department of Revenue, Ministry of Finance, Government of India. It is composed of officers from the Indian Revenue Service, Indian Police Service and the Indian Administrative Service. The origin of this directorate goes back to the 1st of May 1956 when an enforcement unit was formed in Department of Economic Affairs for handling exchange control laws violations under Foreign Exchange Regulation Act 1947. In the year 1957, this unit was renamed as Enforcement Directorate. On the 27th of October 2018, Sanjay Kumar Mishra was appointed as new ed chief for 3 month until new chief is appointed. Objective The prime objective of the Enforcement Directorate is the enforcement of two key acts of the Government of India namely, the Foreign Exchange Management Act 1999 and the Prevention of Money Laundering Act 2002 the EDS Enforcement Directorate official website enlists its other objectives which are primarily linked to checking money laundering in India. In fact this is an investigation agency so providing the complete details on public domain is against the rules of GOI. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Organizational setup. The Directorate of Enforcement with its headquarters at New Delhi is headed by the Director of Enforcement. There are five regional offices at Mumbai, Chennai, Chandigarh, Kolkata and Delhi headed by Special Directors of Enforcement. Zonal offices of the Directorate are at Ahmedabad, Bangalore, Chandigarh, Chennai, Kochi, Delhi, Panaji, Guwahati, Hyderabad, Jaipur, Jalandhar, Kolkata, Lucknow, Mumbai, Patna and Srinagar. These are headed by a Joint Director. The Directorate has sub-zonal offices at Bhubaneswar, Kori Kode, Indore, Madurai, Nagpur, Prayagraj, Raipur, Dehradun, Ranchi, Surat, Shimla and Visakhapatnam which are headed by a Deputy Director. <laughs> <laughs> Special Courts For the trial of an offence punishable under Section 4 of PMLA, the central government in consultation with the Chief Justice of the High Court, designates one or more Sessions Court as special courts. The court is also called, PMLA Court. Any appeal against any order passed by PMLA Court can directly be filed in the High Court for that jurisdiction. <laughs> 